Hello guys, welcome once again. Till now we have learned how to populate our J table and in the previous video we have learned how to use your J slider. Today I'm gonna show you how to use J date chooser. For example, if you want to enter date you have to write like the two zero one two dash two dash zero two. So sometimes it's if you want to enter so many dates and so many data, it's very difficult to type these kind of dates again and again. So today I will show you how to use a date chooser which looks like this and you click this should they get it chooser you can choose any date month and year from here and when you click this date comes here so this is called j date chooser and how can you use it in your program i will show you today so first of all go to your google search or whatever your browser and write it here download so you write this download jcalendar.jar and in the search you can see todter.com just click that and go to its home and you have to download this jcalendar 1.4.zip ok so just click it and save it wherever you want unzip the file and save it at your specified location I have already done that so I don't need to do that so do that and go to your NetBeans IDE and go to your palette right click into your palette and here you will see palette manager click palette manager so palette manager will open and then click add from jar and then wherever you have saved your J calendar just click that I have saved it on my desktop so I am clicking it here just click J calendar and press next and you can see <coughs> so many components are available so for example I want J calendar I will click it this and I will click next and this and here it will show where you want to see your component so I want to see in controls swing controls so I will select that and click finish and close so you can see a new J calendar component will come or appear here and then you just need to drag it here this is the J calendar and we want it J date chooser so once again go to your palette manager add from jar j calendar 1.4 next and we want j date chooser now to choose the date so we choose this press next i want to see it in my swing controls finish close and then you can see j date chooser here 
when you drag it here you can run the program and see how it looks and when you click this thing the date format will appear so you can choose your month the year and the date so just click it and you can use it like that one more thing you can also change the property of this JDS chooser from clicking it and going into the properties in here here date format string you can define what in what format you want to see your date so click here for example I want to see the year first and then the date and then the day click it and paste it here Okay, and click OK and then if you run, run the program and when you click some date it will come in the same format <coughs> as you choose year month and date okay so that was the tutorial on how to use or how to extract your J date chooser I hope you have learned something today and please rate comment and subscribe and thanks for now